What, what did you make of uh, Andy Murray's exploits at Wimbledon the other day? Ah, it's brilliant. You know, uh, I think uh, even though maybe not the biggest tennis fan, but I was I was watching it and getting getting right into it. But I know it's just it's uh, I suppose it's just inspiring really. You know, the, you see how hard he works at his game to be to be the absolute best, and you know you need to take that into um, maybe your own your own your own game, your own career where you know that hard work really really does pay off. It shows you that. So uh, it's brilliant to see. And, you know, it's, uh, it's uh, excellent for the country as well, really. He did very well. Um, you know, I'm glad he's won. Um, he, uh, you know, he's been building himself up over the last few years with this in mind, I think. And, uh, you know, I think it's uh, it was a great performance, a great win. And, you know, I think the crowd, the way they, they brought him on and the hem and heel and things like that, I think it was, uh, it was a great um, spectacle and uh, uh, very good for, for t- uh, British tennis. Uh, last question, did, did you watch Wimbledon? No, we missed it, and uh, we were walking about Trondheim, uh, looking at hotels, and uh, the chairman actually got us lost on the way back to our hotel, and uh, we ended up having to get a taxi. So it was uh, we missed out on it, uh, and we were frantically taxing. I know I was frantically taxing my wife Anne, you know, from the game to see if he'd won, but obviously that's that's great for. Great for Scottish sport and great for uh, you know British sport for for Andy to to win Wimbledon. I think you know he, he's a worthy champion and someone that I think the whole nation was really pleased that uh, you know he he got that uh, title, which I think it was the the one title that he won uh, you know Grand Slam that he really wants and wanted to he wanted to win.